done it with embroidery.com. Welcome to this week's machine embroidery demo. I've got a bunch of fabulous fall and Thanksgiving projects, so we're just gonna jump right in. First up are these adorable fall coasters. Um, in this pack, there are 12 different designs. I've got a handful of them here. I mean, fall is in the air. I love these ones that are totally subway tile, you know, pumpkin spice, harvest, crisp bear, sweaters, uh, pick apples, um, fall, air, you know, you know, leaves, pies, just a total subway tile. I love it. Pumpkin spice and everything nice and fall is in the air. Um, so I paired this pack with some Hemingworth thread. Uh, it includes paprika, ivy, brown sugar, carrot, Indian paintbrush, and old gold. So some fabulous, rich, rich um, fall colors. I love this Indian paintbrush, the burgundy. It just plays so nicely with the oranges and the browns and the yellows of fall. I absolutely love it. And these are just great. I mean, super, super fun uh, coasters. I mean, you could even seal up the envelope in the back, make it a uh, you know, little pin cushion or something. Just amazing possibilities with this design pack. Um, okay, next up is this adorable CD from Kimberbell. It is called uh, Autumn Collection. There are five designs in uh, the CD. There's a turkey, a school bus, an apple, a witch's hat, and a pumpkin. I've got this adorable pumpkin here. So this is all done in the hoop. There are five different sizes, going from extra small to extra large. This is the medium size. So it's about a seven inch uh, around. Um, but I mean, you've got everything, the quilting, the paper piecing look of the a pumpkin, just an amazing touch that you can add to your, you know, fall harvest Thanksgiving kitchen. I mean, it's just super, super cute. But I mean, you've got the turkey in there, the school bus, the witch's hat. I mean, it takes you from September all the way through with, you know, the apple. I love the school bus. Um, the um, wheels of the school bus are buttons, of course. <laughs> okay, so that is the autumn collection from Kimberbell. Next up is this adorable pack. It is called Potholder of the Month. So, of course, you get 12 designs uh, going from January all the way into December. So, look at this adorable turkey. So, this is obviously November's. Um, so she made this one, she made a, tea, a towel, and she also made a pot holder. Um, I love the coordinating fabric on the end of the towel. And then, I mean, it's just, it's so stinking cute. A little bit different um, coloring when she uh, stitched them, but they totally, totally work together. And then this one is December's. Again, she made a flower sex towel, a hand towel, as well as a pot holder. And I just love the coloring. Um, I mean, they couldn't be more different. You know, no November to December is quite different. Um, but I love, I mean, she did snowflake fabric on this one. And again, she added that same fabric down here at the bottom. So I paired this with some Hemingworth thread as well. We've got passion pink, china blue, brown sugar, green apple, Christmas red, and sun. So you've got a lot of different colors in there to get you through January through December. And then you've got something new every single month to change up your kitchen um, to be whatever holiday it is. I think these are just turned out adorable. Okay, you guys, <laughs> this might be one of my favorite things ever. Check out this adorable turkey. Oh my gosh. Okay, so this turkey is available in the um, Kimberbell's Oh, the Possibilities for Fall. There's a CD as well as a book. So, um, and in here you get like 10 different projects. I'll get back to that turkey in a second. There are like, you know, pumpkin wall hangings, pillows that say blessed, cute little pumpkins made out of fabric. A table runner, so many options in this book and CD. I mean, how cute are those cute little muck boots? Welcome fall. I mean, absolutely adorable. 
So by using this uh, book and CD, we created this amazing pillow with this turkey. Look how big that turkey is. And then we picked out some really pretty fallish uh, colors of glitter flex um, and changed out his, um, they're, I mean, they're feathers. Yeah, they're feathers. I was going to say wings, but they're not really wings. They're feathers, right? And then a brown little for his body. And then we stitched it on this burlap. Oh my gosh, I mean, it's definitely not a snuggle pillow, but that's okay because he's so handsome that he is just, you just have to sit and stare at him because he's so cute. Again, I love how big he is. And I mean, the unexpected to do him on burlap is just so, so cute. Um, so that is um, all the possibilities for fall from Kimberbell. Okay, finally is a super cute design pack um, called Thanksgiving Aprons. There are, again, 12 different designs. I love this pillow here in all things gift thanks. Now, this was just a pillow that we picked up at Hobby Lobby, pre-made pillow, um, unpicked the sides, hooped it, stitched it, and then just simply sewed it back up. Um, and I, I love the simplicity of this pillow. Um, because of the same, you know, I mean, you could add a ruffle, you could add extra things, but with the simplicity of the pattern, the design with the, you know, hay stalks and everything and this kind of rustic, uh, potato like, um, fabric, <laughs> I just think it's beautiful. It's a beautiful, beautiful touch. So, so elegant. And then we have this adorable apron. Give, th or give thanks with a grace, grateful heart. And again, this um, amazing, just natural, natural um, apron um, with this beautiful saying on it. It's just like the perfect fall touch. Now, I've paired this pack with some Hemingworth thread as well. We've got pear, pale caramel, <laughs> orange slice, bronze steel, auburn, mulberry, and ginger root. So again, I've got some really rich golds, burgundies, and some oranges in there just to spice things up a little bit for this amazing pack um, for um, a fall and Thanksgiving. Okay, well that is it for today. Head on over to my machine embroidery blog on embroidery.com. I will have all of the um, pictures of the projects I've shown you here today in there, as well as links to all of their um, design packs and thread sets. Uh, make sure you turn your notifications on because that's how you'll know a new video is up. As always, we love to hear your comments and suggestions, so leave those for us below. Thanks for tuning in, everyone. Happy stitching, and we'll see you next time. Bye!